Well, for a number of years we've been associated with Bannon Sloan through the former Sloan IT and also now through Technology of the University of Shannon. Um, in fact, we've actually delivered certificate programs here um, at night time in Bannon Sloan over a number of years, one being an example of the certificate in Biopharmachem. So for us it was a natural partnership when we looked at Bannon Sloan. We said we want to get learning gates. The concept is to, I suppose, utilise the existing remote hubs and make them more effective for learners. So. It was a natural, uh, should we say, location for us to choose. We envisage that at each of the actual hubs, we have uh, office space, you've got rooms, you've got computers, but you, the big thing is you've actually got broadband and warm environments for students to come. They can come and they can study themselves, they can watch the lectures here online, or indeed they can actually have group sessions together. Additionally, if a lecturer is living locally and he chooses not to deliver his class from home, or indeed from the college or the university, he can come in here and deliver from here. Yeah, uh, Lynn and her team, uh, indeed the entire Ballon of Slow Enterprise Centre, they have a fantastic uh, range of facilities and supports for people. So this is a centre, I believe it's open for the community and it's for the community to access and utilise. So uh, if people are interested, they should contact Lynn and her team, Lynn Donnelly and her team here. Right, as, as you all know, uh, Ballon of Slow is located in the county of Galway. It's um, in the electoral area of South West Common and East Galway. But economically, it's probably the strongest link is probably with County Westmeath and the town of Athlone. So it's, it's, it's great to be able to announce today that we're entering into a, a strategic partnership with the new university in Athlone and, and to the new learning centre here. Um, facilities will be available to students both day and night. They'll have key access whenever they want to come in. And um, as I say, this strengthens the economic link. With, with the town over, over to the east. Well, Ballinasloe got selected for this facility because of the facilities that we have here. We're here at the Ballinasloe Enterprise Centre. It's a 27,000 square foot building. We have 27, 28 enterprises here, employing 180 people. And we have the facilities available for, for people to use. So it, it's, it's an ideal uh, to, to work with them. And I suppose that like that, we, we upstairs we have the, the ambulance training service, which is linked to the university in Cork and we also have alignment with the university in, in, in Galway as well. You know? So this is the first time that we were working in cooperation with the new university to our east and I think it makes a good strategic decision uh, for both of us to be working together. This is our first engagement with Athlone. As I say, we have engagement already with University College Cork through the Ambulance Training Centre upstairs. Uh, we have done some programmes with the University College in Galway and we have also links with the Innovation Hub in G um, the, the old GMIT in, in, in Galway, which is now a university as well, you know. So, you know, Ballinasloe, where it's been a central location to Ireland, um, you know, like 40% of the 2.5 million workforce in Ireland are within 60, 70 minutes commuting distance of Ballinasloe. So it's an ideal location for people to use as a remote learning centre through, through this new learning centre.